And welcome to the Cars Land Cup Series. The chase for the 2018 Cars Land Cup Series Cup. The Cars Land Cup. The winner of the championship will be announced the race after this race. And eight drivers will be racing today. After this race, four will be eliminated. Let's look at our drivers underneath the cutoff. Lowest underneath the cutoff is Danica Patrick. She has not been very consistent in this round. They feel they need to get at least a top five today if they're going to make it. Then we have Mark Martin. They feel they need to be just a bit faster here at this road course and maybe get a win today. Jimmy Johnson was expected to be one of the guys to easily make it in with no problem. He's just a little bit under the cutoff, not by much. He's got uh one drive he's got one driver he need two drivers he needs to get by if he's gonna um make it to the championship four with uh Mark with uh Trevor Bain and Jeff Gordon who were advanced. And one other driver will make it to the championship four also. Also Dale Earnhardt Sr. they feel they need just to be a bit faster. Almost got a win not too long ago at the Supercuts 350, which was not um, put on YouTube. It was attempted to put on YouTube. Trevor Bain won that race and advanced himself to the championship four. Dale Sr. finished second. And that is some checkups then. Cole Witt looking to be the fastest non-playoff driver other than Joey Logano. They had a bit of trouble in... Uh, Qualify, but they were making some extremely fast practice laps next. They are trying to get a win today, as this is going to be the final road course of the season here at the Glen. And also, um, second to last race for drivers to get more wins. We'll see who's going to be racing at it. The 68 to the back for, um, Unapproved body modif not modifications after practice that will put them to the back and they're gonna have to fight to the top. Also, a bit of a winter wonderland as we wake up here at the Glen. That's a live look at Zach 103 TV Raceway. And also, uh, the Glen. Um, no problems today with racing. We look to be green most of today's race. Pretty good forecast, a little bit of rain and snow predicted, not a big problem. They may need to clean the track up just a bit after uh, the first or second caution. Um, will be a competition caution lap 7 for rain last night and snow. Um, we're going to get this race started. Also, starting on the front row, we have Bill Elliott and Greg Galding. We're going to see how they start out today here at the Watkins Glen, the New England Patriots 500. Green flag in the air here at the New England Patriots 500 here at Watkins Glen in Watkins Glen, New York. Oh, and Bill Elliott spins the tires on the initial start. And again, this is a bit of a different formation of Watkins Glen we're kind of we kind of changed the formation over there so drivers wouldn't have such a hard time getting off those turns. There's still the chicane and two carousels actually. That one's actually cut a bit. This is an initial carousel right here that was also changed and a bit of a cut there. So Greg Galding with the lead coming into the chicane for the first time. Oh, Gray Galding spins. The track is wet. Jeff Burton sliding. He's going to probably save it, but Gray Galding going to hit that wall there, it looks like. The top three will crash. Maybe Jeff maybe Jeff Gordon and Trevor Bain might not be getting involved, but this is going to end Gray Galding's day already, it looks like. And this incident right here is going to put us in red flag condition for track cleanup. And that's going to end Gray Galding's day. As that was the end of the crash, Je uh, Mar uh, these guys easily made it through. Um, had to avoid J Joe Nemechek a bit, but no biggie there. Joe Nemechek, I'm sure if they can continue. Uh, they cannot start working on the cars until the red flag is lifted. 
Billy Elliott believes they can still race. Um, and they came in this race third in points now. Um, their um, playoff hopes are dwindling right now. They're three positions below the cutoff, it looks like. And they they they're gonna have to work pretty hard these few few laps and red flag is out for precipitation and uh track cleanup for the twenty three of Greg Galding. Some slight precipitation out there, but it shouldn't affect the race. It's really just the cleanup. Um because the track is wet in the chicane. So um something the Something they will be working on. And, uh, just a reminder, next race, they will be racing for a championship at Cars Land Speedway. Be sure to watch that. Yellow flag is now in the air, and the crews are starting to work on the Cars Land Pit Road, which includes Joe Nemechek and Bill Elliott. The green will probably come out right as Bill Elliott comes out of Pit Road. We don't know. Bill Elliott out of pit road. They believe they can still run fast. Just a bit of um, damage there. It really, could, it really does affect aerodynamics. But at this former racetrack, that's not a huge factor. But not willing to take chances here. They're really going to have to go for it. And they're going to have to work if they're going to get into that championship four. Again, again, three positions underneath that cutoff line. And Joe Nemechek, his... Championship hopes are gone now because he did not pass the crash clock. He will go to the garage. Very disappointing for that 25 team. They only got one win this season. They thought they had a good chance for a championship, but doesn't look to be this season. And believe it or not, there are actually more than that many drivers in the playoff in the round eight that only got one win this season. That includes the three of Dale Sr., the six of Mark Martin, the ten of Danica Patrick, and the twenty-five of Mark Martin. Mark Martin. The forty-eight has believed two wins. And you know that twenty-five team, they thought they had a good chance. But what does that put in the minds of the three cars that are barely above the cutoff there's two of them are under the cutoff so yeah coming through the gears are going to restart lap three here at Watkins Glen New York the New York the, the, the New England Patriots 500 and this is this is going to be lap three Jeff Gordon with a fairly well start, but the six of Trevor Bang gets a better start with a push from Dale Sr. Jeff Gordon and Trevor Bang go side by side into the chicane. This time the field does not foul out near as quickly as they did on the initial start of the race. Major things going on right now. Transitions in the top five spots, and they're three wide in the chicane. Oh, cars are having troubles in the backstretch. I believe we'll stay green if... It's not too bad. We look to stay green. Or well, at least that's what it looks like. It looks that we stay green, probably. And now we have Dale Jarrett around. And this looks to be a... We look to stay green after this one, too. But, gee golly. He got off of the turn side by side with William Byron and spun. So, look to stay green once more. I don't know for the lead starting to cook though. Oh, trouble! Chase Elliott into Dale Jared. Oh goodness! Nose to nose, Dale Jared was trying to go back around. He spun backwards and was trying to get out of the way, but Chase Elliott had a similar situation happen to him with Ryan Newman, and he slammed right in front of Dale Jared. And Chase Elliott wasn't gonna spin out either. He was going head on into Nail Jared. This is going to put out a caution and uh, this will be counted as our competition caution on lap five no lap four 
So we'll restart lap six. This will count as our competition caution. The 88 and the 24 both out of the race. Their day's done. The 88 thought they had a fast car. Span out and then the 24 head on into that car. Putting out caution. Uh, area's clean. We're going to go green this time by. Uh, the 10, the 96, and the 41 went to pit road. Got some fresh tires and fuel. And the 10, a playoff driver, um, they were involved in that little incident there. We'll restart lap 6. Going through the gears, through the Microsoft restart zone, green flag is once again in the air here at Watkins Glen. The snow is falling. They could put out the red flag or the caution. The officials for the Cars Line Cup Series really hoping they don't have to do that. And we're going to look at them go through turn one right now. Equal through turn one. Going towards the chicane. Side by side off the chicane. Look at Sebastian Kukulon running fourth. The uh, fastest running non-playoff driver. Cole Witt following him right now. And uh, think about making a pass on Mark Martin and Sebastian Kukulon. It may be coming for a win. Sebastian Kukulon dives to the <coughs> excuse me. Sebastian Kukulon dives to the bottom. Trevor Bank could not hug the bottom. Here comes Sebastian Kukulon the two. Is there any room? Sebastian Kukulon moves the six, which triggers the twenty-four up the track. Holy cow, this is getting crazy. Mark Martin will completely destroy his car into the wall. His day's done. His championship hopes are gone. And also, the Cars Line Cup Series officials will call the race due to snow falling all over the racetrack. And Zachary Moore 3 Raceway as well. But this will end the race. Devastating. For Bill Elliott in the 94, the 10 of Danica Patrick, and if the six were just a point, uh, just a position ahead before that caution came out, well, two positions ahead, they would have advanced to the championship four, but they will not. Here's your championship four, an underdog, a three of Dale Senior is third going to be starting the championship four and the 48 is advanced will have advanced the championship four the 94 their their championship hopes for 2018 are gone the race is over mark martin a bit woozied up there and what could be one of his last few races. Well, no, he's probably going to be racing next season. But Sebastian Kukulon stole a win there. Congratulations for Sebastian Kukulon for winning the New England Patriots 500 at the Watkins Glen. There's Sebastian Kukulon, the winner of the New England Patriots 500 at Watkins Glen. His second career win. Then here's your guys who will advance to the championship four. Trevor Bain, Jeff Gordon, Dale Earnhardt Sr. in Fireball 398 for Jimmy Johnson. Um, Abigail Lane for the three. Connie Ragsdale for the 24. And Just Cuz YT Vlogs for the six. This will be Trevor Bain's second run for a championship. This time he looks a lot faster. And might have a chance at Cars Land Speedway, but he struggled at that track. So, we don't know what to see next race. Also, the 94, very disappointed. Who should they be mad at? Well, they should be mad at the 23, but they had a good season in the playoff system. They'll probably do better next race. Last race, they actually, last season... And the, at the uh, Cars Land Speedway, um, they wrecked Trevor Bain for no 
reason, but I don't really understand that. But, um, playoff hopes gone for Mark Martin, Bill Elliott, Danica Patrick, and the 25 Joe Nemechek who racked out in the first, on the first lap. And these are your championship four and the race winner, Sebastian Kukulon. So let's look at what to expect for the Cars Land, the Cars Land Speedway race. The uh, race is already sponsored. I forgot it right off the bat, but the race logo will come out sometime this week. This will be a good race. Expect it to be. This race was delayed because I wanted to watch NASCAR on Sunday, the Cup Series race. My bad, but um, more things will be released on Twitter. Um, my Twitter account is at Zach103TV. I'm not going to put a link because you can just easily search it up. If you want me to put a link, let me know in the comments. I'll edit the video, put a link in. Also, I'll have a link to the Cars Lane Cup Series Discord server. Probably not the website because the website's kind of dead right now. I might work on that in a little bit, but... Um, Cars Land Cup Series, the championship for Trevor Bain, Jimmy Johnson, Jeff Gordon, Dale Sr. will be racing for a championship at Cars Land Speedway exactly on um, Sunday. Oh, I don't even know. Sunday, November something. It'll probably come on, it'll probably be on YouTube sometime net around, a little bit before the cup race probably. But, who knows? You can see anything. This is Zach going through TV with the Cars Line Cup Series Chase for the Cup 2018. I'll be releasing the playoff grid on Twitter and the car the Cars Lane Cup Series Discord server after the Cars Lane Cup Series race is uploaded. I don't know. Things can change. But thank you for watching. This is Zach on 3 TV and the Cars Lane Cup Series signing out.